We have Warriors forward Niall Ryder here with us. Niall, uh, another great win against our local rivals. Hi, it was good. I, it, it's a bit of a shame because obviously like the atmosphere used to be a lot better whereas the fans just make no noise now. So I think that's like an aspect as why Billingham are struggling this season. The fans are just purely quiet. Apart from like three at the front, that's about it. The thing is that they've got some like good forwards like on the paper, but defensively, like obviously they're struggling a lot. But I assume they'll come back. I'm expecting a hard game in the cup games, and that's what we want, though. No one wants an easy game, you know. Everyone wants the fans involved, not just our fans screaming on and all them sitting quiet. So it was good, eh? Obviously, we're out the traps pretty quick, getting them three fast goals in the first 90 seconds. But after our timeout, it sort of worked in Billingham's favour, didn't it? And they come back into the game. 100%. We said in the first, obviously, last week we did exactly the same. We started off really well. And honestly, I think about after 10 minutes of the first, we just stooped down to their level. You know, we literally just, we said the lads in the room at the end of the second, we said, we can't stoop down their level. We need to keep going. You know, we're, we're going up there to win the league. And that's what we want to do. So when you're playing the likes of Billingham and Nottingham, you can't just stoop down their level and play it awful. You need to, like, step it up again and play like you would against the top teams. Yeah, exactly. Now, you mentioned before the Cup semi final, which is about three weeks away, I think. Uh, what do we need to do to not fall into our trap again? Yeah, I, I, like I say, the lads know know what the crack is now, so we'll go back to training this week. Obviously, we'll have a bit of time off, and hopefully like we'll have the legs going in them games. We haven't played much, obviously, so I think it's just a fatigue factor. But obviously, we're, we're here to win the treble, so I've got no doubt in my mind that we're going to blow Billing away in both them games and carry on. So. And for you tonight, obviously on the second line, must have been good to get some increased minutes. Uh, it was good, I Obviously getting the goal and that, but obviously the lads were first, he's out on the bench, I wasn't there to fill the water bottles up, but... It'd be nice to get a goal against the top teams instead of likes of Nottingham and Billingham and all that. You know, it's not really anything I'm proud of. So, right. it's nice to put them uh, bench rider comments to bed, oh, though, isn't it? It's, it's just laugh on the part. The fans pay their money. You get a few clowns online, they obviously want to have a go at you and all that. But it's part of the game. I'll give it back to them as much, and we'll laugh about it. So, that was good. That's great. Now, thank you very much, and good luck for the rest of the season. Cheers, lads, anyway.